when you and I were growing up, um, pharmaceutical companies did not advertise. And mm -hmm. now you watch anything on TV and, yeah. and it says, is your knee sore? Well, you must have this disease. Go ask your doctor right, right. about it. And then all of a sudden, I think I have a condition. Uh, how, how much did that play into really what's blown up in the last 20, 30 years? It, it certainly expanded. And you know, I'm a, I'm a free market kind of guy. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm almost, even though I'd like to see the, these things gone because mm -hmm. I think they're very deceptive, um, you know, they always have the little scroll at the end, this is, it could, could, could kill you, <laughs> you know, that kind of thing. But the reality is, yes, when you hear of kids going into their pediatrician, right, with their parents, and they mm -hmm. ask their doctor, hey, do you have some Lunesta? Because there's a, you know, there's a pretty butterfly sure. in the Lunesta yep. commercial, right? You don't think that's impacting children's thought forms as they age? Mm -hmm. On top of what I mentioned, that the, the parents, by and large, just, you know, take drugs. It's just a matter of course, because they were programmed even before we had these commercials. So I'm not a big fan of them, but you know, mm -hmm. if there were truth in advertising, perhaps it would be a little better in that <laughs> regard. But direct-to-consumer marketing certainly has increased the bottom line for the drug industry. They wouldn't have you know, lobbied it into existence. And therefore, big media is going to attack people that do alternative medicine. Why? Because it's going to fundamentally hit their bottom sure. line. You know, that, the drug commercial, are you kidding me? Do you realize that a lot of what you see on the news is what we call pre-produced news from public relations agencies throughout the world or even on Madison Avenue in New York if they're still mm -hmm. there. Literally produced by drug industry and they supply complete news to the evening news, to CNN, mm -hmm. to, to, to Fox, to all of these things. And they play it out like it's actually, oh, this is news. We, this was made by drug companies. And that's why the, ro the, the growth of the new media is so very important. You know, with naturalnews.com, what mm -hmm. uh, Mike Adams does, the Health Ranger, Joe Mercola with Mercola, what I do with the Robert Scott Bell Show. People are flocking now to this new media or alternative media. And there's even an alternative news site now opening up, like a Drudge Report for alternative news, mm -hmm. because people are realizing they're getting beyond biased information, corrupt and toxic information through what they call news, which is not news, which is pure propaganda now. Mm -hmm.